What's up guys? I just wanted to do a quick review after we installed our offset coupler here for our air intake system. Uh, by the way, before we get into the video, if you're new here, if this is your first time to the channel, go ahead and tap that subscribe button, give the video a thumbs up, drop a comment below, share the video if you like. We've had an issue with our intake system. I have a few videos on that. If you want to keep updated with those, go back and watch those and see what took place with this here. But what happens with this is this doesn't fit 100% like OEM. So when I bought it, after about a couple months or so, this thing starts shimming out of place. I'm talking about there was a huge gap right here, probably about an inch, two inch gap right here. And that's because this thing was sliding out of place because it didn't fit quite properly, probably about 90% of fit. Um, and over time, due to vibration, it shimmies out of place. So uh, what I did was I put on this offset coupler. It sort of comes to the it sort of comes offset to the left a little bit or to the right. Your right, my left or my right, your left. <laughs> um, but anyways, it comes offset. It curves over a little bit so that it's more in inward because again this this piece was shimmy out of place and there was a huge gap right here but to remedy that we took our offset coupler put that on and also what is key i believe was these nuts and bolts here these two clamps i end up snipping these and cutting them down to about one inch this bolt here was actually out about four inches so if you have a deep socket, you can only snug it down, but so tight. And when it's not tight, obviously it's gonna shimmy out of place even more. So what I did was I cut this bolt down to about one inch, got a deep socket, and I was able to snug these down really, really, really tight so that this thing hasn't moved. And ever since we put the offset coupler on and cut these uh, bolts here, this thing has not budged. But this is something that ha that has to be done. It must be done. Otherwise, you'll go and look at your intake and this thing will be way out of place. Trust me. So one, you have to get the offset, offset coupler. I'll put a link in the description. Get the offset coupler. And then you have to cut these. Get a bolt cutter. Cut these down to about one inch. Get a deep socket and snug these all the way tight down. Spin them down. And that way, this thing will not budge. Trust me. A lot of guys had issues with the AFE power, cold air intake, the GT momentum. And this is a great, great unit. You got the sight glass. I'm about due for a filter clean. You got the sight glass. It's fully enclosed housing. It's not going to get wet and debris or anything on it. And I love the unit. It just doesn't fit 100% properly. Now it does because of, you know, the fix we did. We put the offset coupler and we cut the bolts down, snugged them down real tight now it actually fits i have had no problem guys but this is something that must be done with this cold air intake system it has to be done in order for your intake to stay in place so if you guys appreciated this video if you enjoyed the video give it a thumbs up smash that subscribe button tap the notification bell because we got more great content on the way until next time i will see you guys in the next video alex's rt life signing